build these people up over this 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 serious investment of your life into them. You breathe life into them, starting from the bottom. Where is your head at after this as yeah. far as what your next step? Yeah. I literally began to look for work in April. So I give the message that we're leaving. I still am carrying the beeper. I literally was the person that shut the lights off at H&R Block Mortgage. And I mean that, me and Mike Coffey, who was the chief operating officer of the entire retail division, we literally were the last two people. Like he was based out of Florida. Um, he's an executive still to this day in the mortgage industry for another company now. Um, but we're forever bonded by the moment of literally walking out and like being the last person standing. And so, you know, I, I, I started to look around. There were jobs available. There were big companies that were offering me regional level jobs, which was the next step down from where I had, I had achieved. Um, and my ego told me to take those jobs, my, this side of my brain. Um, because I could have a big title and I had really worked hard to get where I was. The compassionate side of me warned me that I would be taking this job for the title and maybe even for the pay, but I would be going into other companies where I might have to repeat what I just did at H&R Block, which is shrink the companies. Like my job of taking the helms of those positions might have been more consolidation for those companies. And it was already hard to do with people that I love let alone to do it with people that didn't know me. Because now if you're doing that with people that don't know you, you're just you're just the, the gunslinger. And I thought, does my ego really need to have this title on this business card? Or do I need to do something? What is true about me? And I thought, I love growing things. And it was the first time in my life that I realized I needed to overcome my own ego. Wow. And I would accept a position for a then non-mortgage a uh, guy who had 52 loan officers out of Waltham, uh, Lentegra Mortgage, and he needed somebody with mortgage specific experience. And he was moving his family cross country to California to take a position in the IT world, which is the world that he uh, had grown up in professionally. And he wanted someone to watch the shop that he had built. And it was a profitable shop at the time. And so I took that job. 